Hi and welcome back to the channel for the second time in a few hours. The video that came out earlier uh, I filmed yesterday and my hair is now down. I'm not wearing this still. Um, I have a singlet on underneath because it's really warm. But I don't feel comfortable wearing a singlet on camera. So I just put this over the top for both videos. Uh, but at least this time this uh, shirt is actually relevant to the topic because we're going to be talking about Mars Argo. Now I think it has been a little bit since I've spoken about Mars Argo, I'm not exactly sure. But yesterday, I want to say yesterday, a couple of photos leaked and Jordan messaged me this morning and asked me if I knew about the Pinterest account or what the Pinterest account was that the photos came from. And so both of these photos were uploaded to a Pinterest account. And that Pinterest account is called Brittany. And the username is Winston in space. This name and username has led fans, including myself, at least for a little bit, uh, that this may actually be Brittany uh, teasing new music. But... As with everything, there's more to it than that. And I just want to quickly run you through, I guess, the truth behind the leaks. I quickly want to start with, I don't think that's exactly an order for these photos, but uh, this photo actually looks a lot like a photo from Britney's acting resume video. And the other photo is the same jacket and looks very kind of similar, I suppose, in a way to this photo, which leaked uh, late last year. So it's unknown how recent these photos are. I would say that they could both potentially be this year. The first one looks like it's in the same room, and the second one is the same jacket. So they could both be from similar times and so that would mean that one is probably 2017 and the other one potentially this year or 2017 as well not 100% sure how do you confirm the dates I don't know when Jordan messaged me about a Pinterest account uh, posting these I automatically thought oh it must be the account that posted the behind the scenes photo from Amanita but it wasn't if you go to the account, you'll see that there are three boards, one called Britney Sheets, uh, Make Your Own First Business and Things That Make Me Laugh. Uh, this account is a few years old, I think four years old from what I read, and the Make Your Own First Business thing is a pin of some CNN ad. But if you go to the following, there's three people, Samantha Kaiser, Cheshire Cap, and Joel Armstrong. Now, I looked and uh, neither Joel nor Samantha that I found have ever been associated with Britney or the Mars Argo band. So that wasn't necessarily a red flag for me. I was like, well, I think Joel makes art so he could be doing some artwork for Britney. I don't know what Samantha does. but um, And Cheshire Cat, I think, is just a Disney fan thing. This account is also following three boards, which are Ha Ha Ha, Video Games, and Illustration. But what tells me that it isn't, in fact, Britney is a few things. And one is that if you Google Winston in space, Pinterest, or Google, nothing comes up. The account doesn't come up at all. And what also further highlights this is if you go to the Wayback Machine and it's actually been done by people apart from me because I went to go and save it uh, and there's like six captures and they were all yesterday or today essentially. But what happens when you go to the Pinterest address on the Wayback Machine is it says whoops we couldn't find that page. So what this tells me is that the username and name, I guess, were potentially changed uh, recently. Now, I don't know how recently because uh, one of these photos has a 
comment from the 19th of December, which was days before uh, these photos came out from a fan account, which is also called Britney Sheets. And it may be the same person with two accounts, I don't know. Because how do you find this? I don't know. I guess the question is, isn't Mars teasing new music? And I want to say no. And I don't want to break your heart or anything, but I just think that these photos were found somehow, much like the Amanita behind the scenes. Um, and before you go saying about the Amanita behind the scenes, that, oh, it was Tony Kate. I messaged him and he said that he had no idea how uh, someone got that photo. I, I don't know how these were found, but I am pretty sure that it was not Brittany herself. But I guess we'll see if there's future uploads. I'm not going to theorise as to how they were found because I don't want to chuck around accusations. As far as I know, the person who found the Amanita behind the scenes photo, or at least posted it, never responded as to its original source. And I don't think we'll ever find the original source for this as well. Because if you reverse image search it, nothing comes up. And in case you're wondering, from what I could find, there is no set limit to editing your username or changing it. There's no like limit, like I think YouTube has, you can change your name like three times in 90 days or a month, something like that. And you can also edit your name anytime. So that says to me that it could very easily have been done by someone who was trying to, I suppose, create hype. But yes, initially, when I saw Winston in space and Brittany, I thought that it was potentially actually Brittany. Um, and Winston in space, if you Google just Winston in space, uh, with no spaces, ironically, um, nothing comes up. And so, yeah. And also, oddly enough, it's saved to, I think the board is called Brittany Sheets, which is just odd. Anyway, thanks for watching, and if you do enjoy the video, don't forget to leave a like. And this time the outro actually has a song, because I forgot to add a song at the end of last video. Uh, but yeah, yeah, have a great day, and uh, I'll see you soon for more content.